Good day, everyone. We're coming on the air with breaking news in the United Kingdom, where King Charles III has been diagnosed with cancer. Buckingham Palace just confirming the news in a statement, but not saying which type of cancer. The palace says his medical team identified, quote, a separate issue of concern while he was being treated for a benign prostate enlargement last month. The palace also says he will postpone public facing duties while he undergoes treatment. It comes less than a year since his coronation. Let's go straight to our chief international correspondent, Keir Simmons. Now he's covered the royal family for years. What more can you tell us, Keir? Well, Lester, this will be a shock to many people because uh, Prince, uh, King Charles was was in the hospital just last week, uh, and the understanding was that it was a treatment uh, for a benign condition, a benign prostate condition. So I'm going to read to you, Lester, some of that statement uh, that Buckingham Palace is, is releasing uh, right now uh, so people can hear what exactly the palace is saying. That statement reads, During the King's recent hospital procedure for benign prostate enlargement, a separate issue of concern was noted. Subsequent <clears throat> diagnostic tests have identified a form of cancer. His Majesty has today commenced a schedule of regular treatments, during which time he, will, he has been advised by doctors to postpone public-facing duties, as you mentioned, Lester. Throughout this period, His Majesty will continue to undertake state business and official paperwork as usual. The statement goes on to say that the King is grateful to his uh, medical team and then uh, repeats again what had been said uh, last week was that he was hoping that uh, others would uh, learn from his experience and ensure, for example, that they get checked. Well, now I, I, I can imagine that he feels even more so uh, that way because uh, that three day, three nights in the hospital uh, last week uh, seemed to be, uh, to some extent, the end of the matter. We were told that he uh, would take a, a month uh, to uh, slow down a little and, and to recover a little bit. But just yesterday, we saw him at church with uh, Queen Camilla uh, waving to the crowd. So uh, there didn't seem to be anything wrong. And again, as you mentioned, Lester, we, we don't know uh, what uh, type of, what form of cancer uh, this is. So it, it's difficult to speculate beyond what we've been told by the palace, uh, but it will be a blow for the royal family. As you, as you mentioned, uh, Queen Elizabeth uh, dying uh, so recently and, and King Charles becoming a king just in the, the past year. Uh, this, after, for the royal family, after a period, let's be honest, of, of very difficult times, uh, this will be another challenge. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.